tonight we are in Mount Dora and behind us is El Mezcal Mexican Restaurant. It's also right next to the Waffle House we went to, which is right there. It looks really, really good. Uh, not sure what they have. It was not a suggestion. We just found it and we're going to go in and see what they have to offer. Let's go check it out. Right here is the Waffle House. It was a good Waffle House. And then in this little shopping center area is El Mezcal. Let's see what the hours are. Walking up to the door, they've got some outdoor seating, which is really nice. Look at the lights above it. And then store hours, Monday through Thursday, 11 to nine, Friday, 11 to 10, Saturday, 11 to 10, Sunday, 11 to nine. And this is what the inside looks like. We've got some decorations in here and a tree and the bars right over there. Heading this way, we're gonna have a seat right here. All right, here's an overview of what it looks like. There's where we came in. They've got the tree right here. And then up over here is the bar. I can't really show it because there's someone sitting there, but right behind me, just down this little walkway are the restrooms. And back in the corner, like I mentioned before, are the restrooms, women, men. Here's a look at the chips and salsa. Very excited for that. And then as far as the specials go, we're here on a Wednesday and they didn't really have like a, a super good deal, I guess, on margaritas. They said they had the larger, I think she said the larger, maybe it was this right here, the, the large house margarita, but I thought she said for like $10, but maybe, maybe, maybe it's that. I don't know. I got that. We'll see if it's a special or not. She said it is really, really good. But if we're looking at the drink menu, let's just go down the list here. Looks like they've got a really good selection of drinks. Mexican tea. And then over here they have some more drinks. There's the appetizers. Looks like they got several little dips right there. And then on the back side, these, they're fast here. I'm not even done with this menu and they've already brought the cheese dip. We did order a cheese dip and the drink. Holy smokes, that's a very large drink. Okay, the desserts. A chimmy cheesecake. Ooh, that sounds very good. Let's have a look at the actual menu. Expect the best. So we did get that queso dip. It's a little pricey for the queso dip, but it kind of seems like that's the standard now. Kind of the starters. There's the salads, chicken tortilla soup. And over here we have the sizzling fajitas. That's not a bad price for the fajitas. Burritos. Quesadillas. I'll have to see if they have just the standard cheese quesadilla. More items here, chicken pork steak. It's a very large menu. There's that raspberry chipotle salmon that pops up almost every time. Tacos. Next page we have combos. Top with queso dip for $2 more. That's always a good option. So there's some combos they have, some veggie fajitas, some enchiladas, white enchiladas. Here is the lunch served between 11 and two, Monday through Friday. Kind of give an overview of what the lunch looks like. And then down here we have the sides and I bet we'll have, yep, cheese quesadilla right there. I might try that as well. I'm not sure, but I always like trying them. And then if we turn the page, it shows they have two locations, one in Ocala and one in Mount Dora. That's a large menu. Like I said a second ago, they already brought the cheese dip and just to compare like this margarita to a regular drink, it's, it's, it's large. I'm not sure what the ounces are, but it's large. Not sure what we're getting. I think at this location, we're gonna split the chicken fajitas. And then I'll probably end up getting a little quesadilla as well. All right, let's give this big drink a try. Yeah, that's a decent margarita. 
just for comparison. Look at this. All right, I asked her about this drink, and this is the 32 ounce margarita for $10.29, which may seem high, but she said it's all day, every day. They're like 24 ounce or 25 ounce is $9. And they're, I think it's on the menu, they're like 16 ounce is like $7. So you get double of the 16 ounce for 10.29. She said that's their special. Here's the consistency of the cheese dip. Looks pretty thick, looks good. First bite of the cheese dip, what'd you think? And you did the salsa too? Yeah, like I always do. Is it spicy salsa? It's got a little bit of spice. I don't know if it's the cheese or the salsa, but there's a little bit of spice. It's good though. Cool. There's a bite of the cheese dip. I think the cheese dip's a little spicy. It's good though. It's good. It's thick. Now let's try the salsa. There we go. That's good salsa. Yeah, I think it's the cheese dip that's spicy. So far, I am really enjoying this. It's very good, and they're very fast at bringing stuff. I love their ceiling in here, the brick and the tree right in the middle. And they already brought it out. Look at the steam coming off the pitas. That is a lot of chicken and veggies for the fajita. So we have that. We have obviously that. The tor tortillas there. And then here's the cheese quesadilla. We'll have to try that out. Now, I did not order the fajitas for two. I just ordered the chicken fajitas to share. So we'll have to see on the bill if they charged us for the two one, which we didn't want, or if they charged us just for the single. But if that's the single, that's the most fajita, I'm gonna call it fajita guts, I've ever seen. It does come with three tortillas. So we have one over there, these. You are eating one. Let's try the fajita. That's tasty. That's a good fajita. I like that a lot. Oh, it looks like they've got a guacamole little bar. Look at that. How was it? It's good. It's still very warm though. Yeah. Like I can feel the chicken through the tortilla. Here's the quesadilla. So they don't cut it in force, they cut it in halves. Let's try that. There it is. I mean, it's a decent cheese quesadilla. Probably not the best I've ever had. So if it's like $5, totally not worth $5. If it's like $3, I would get it for $3. So we have eaten all the tortillas and look, there's still all that left. So we're gonna nibble on that. I still have half of the quesadilla. You do get very large portions here, very. And I'm still working on that. All right, here's where we're at. We've almost finished the cheese dip. There's still a lot there. So I'm gonna get a box to go. I would love to try the, the dessert, but I think I'm gonna be way too full because I still have to drink the drink too. But everything was good. I really like this place a lot. Here is the bill. So they only charge us for one fajita, which is what we wanted. We only share the one. Definitely a lot of food. Would you agree with that? I mean, a ton of food. So we're gonna get, we got a box for that. Like I said before, I would love to get dessert, but there's no way we are stuffed. We are stuffed and we are heading out. All right, that was our trip out to El Mezcal in, sorry, there we go, in Mount Dora. Honestly, I, I don't think I have any complaints. No, it was a pretty restaurant and all the food was good. Yeah, that's a good word, pretty, because it really was like kind of different from the design on the inside. I showed the ceiling of uh, the brick ceiling and it's different than what you normally see at a Mexican restaurant, but really enjoyed it. I could not, I mean, I, I could have, but I chose not to finish that margarita. It is huge. Mm -hmm. Like if you want to, so it was $40.00. You could share the fajitas easily. You did not need a cheese quesadilla. And it wasn't really worth the price. Maybe if I had a complaint that cheese quesadilla, but you could Nothing go in there. Nothing wrong with it. it just no, wasn't it like just wasn't worth, it. I think it was like four, <laughs> what was four fifty nine or something. Um, go in there, just get uh, fajitas for, what is it, fifteen ninety nine. Mm -hmm. Easily can share it. I, we have a to go box. To go. And then share a margarita because it's huge and you can get out of there for 25 bucks. Cheese dip though. Cheese dip, that's right. So 30 bucks prior to tip. Cheese dip was good. Yeah, it was really good, cheese dip. Um, definitely a place you must try. It's, again, right next to the Waffle House here in Mount Dora that we tried. And it was good. It was very, I mean, it's crowded. People were in there, um, but we enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. With that being said, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.